Today is also the day of Taylor Swift's Eras Tour in Tokyo, Japan. Tomorrow is Sub 11. Tomorrow is also the Super Bowl, which is going to be held in Las Vegas. Taylor is all the way on the other side of the world, while Travis Kelsey is playing in the Super Bowl in Las Vegas. How is she get to get from here all the way to there? Well, let's get into that. But first, let's discuss how exactly this whole thing started for the people in the back who don't even know that Taylor's dating someone new because apparently some people don't. So Taylor and Travis started officially dating on December 6th, but this is basically how that started. Travis actually went to one of Taylor Swift's concerts and he tried to give her a friendship bracelet that had his phone number on it. And it was really cute, but Taylor doesn't meet with people before or after concerts. So he kind of felt a little, a little rejected that she was like, nah, I'm not, I'm not meeting with this guy. So after he gets rejected, at the heiress tour he asks her to uh attend one of his kansas city football games and she agrees to this i don't know why she just does she agrees to go to this football game on september 24th and things kind of just went uphill from there they kind of just clicked uh and on december 6th as i just said, stated um they went on their first date and taylor actually describes this disastrous first date on the tonight show so you can watch that if you want it's literally on their youtube channel google it anyways going back to the point of this whole video how's taylor gonna get from tokyo japan to las vegas in the united states in one day in feb 10th to feb 11th well it's actually kind of genius so she's going to leave tokyo japan at midnight and by that calculation she should make it to las vegas at 7 a.m and it seems like a pretty solid plan you know she'll be there by 7 a.m and she won't have uh, like to worry about it but here's the thing about that um there's a lot of speculation that maybe that won't happen because it is the super bowl and on Feb 11th, Las Vegas airports are usually booked to the max and Las Vegas airports usually reach their full capacity on private planes, which we're all assuming Taylor Swift will obviously go on a private plane. And another thing to put into consideration is that the NFL does not actually compensate for private jets or like or for like any airport transportation for that matter. And there are possibilities of 11 to 12 hour delays. So there is possibility that Taylor Swift will make it the exact night of the Super Bowl if she even finds parking space, which is also packed. One of the sports, one of the sports, one of the spokespersons from the FFA stated that they are completely booked. And on Wednesday, they had 56.7 million passengers. That's a lot of people, if you didn't know. On average, the Las Vegas airport carries at least 1,600 people. So the chances of Taylor Swift getting a parking spot, getting a private plane, being able to even leave on time, and reaching the Super Bowl the night of Travis Kelsey playing, it's going to be a little bit of a stretch. Because she's in Asia, and he's in... I don't know if you know, but that's a different continent. That's that's a completely different continent that she has to fly over. So Taylor Swift's also switching between nine different time zones. Anyways, now that that's all the way, despite all of this, the NBC News also states that Taylor Swift will comfortably make it to the Super Bowl if she flies on the Falcon 900XL or the Falcon 7X. Well, you see, there's a lot of different things to consider because there's only 475 parking spots. Even if Taylor Swift can make it in the time because of how fast her plane is, there's no guarantee that she's going to be able to put the plane somewhere. She can't just put it in her pocket and walk out. But anyways, anyways, another thing that's to take into perspective 
is that her show in Tokyo starts at 8 p.m. and ends at 11.15 p.m. So this woman has 45 minutes to literally get, like, take off, because she's going to have to take out, take off at 12. If she makes it, this is literally going to blow my mind, because there are so many speculations going against her. But if she does make it, we all can just agree, she is Taylor Swift, so... Anyways, I hope you liked my insight on Taylor Swift's Super Bowl era. Anyways, goodbye.